Hi, I'm Melissa and I'm a designer here at Queensbury. So you've set up a price list and it's now attached to your event. You're now ready to share the gallery with your clients so they can start purchasing. So this is an open gallery here and the first indication that I've added a price list is this shopping cart icon is showing in the top right. So if we scroll down and to view the images how your client would order products is they would hover over the image and here you can see they can share it, favorite the image or add it to their shopping cart. Also if you have added digital downloads to the price list it will show up here. Cool, so I'm just going to order a few prints. What's really great is you can be a New Zealand based photographer but for example your client's mother lives in London she can purchase products from your cart and we can ship to her directly. And the buy products pop up will show up. So on the left is the products that you've included in the price list and there's also um, a few images and a description that shows as well. Now this login pop-up will appear. Why would your clients need a login? They can save favorite images. This is a great tool for selecting images for say an album design. And also they can save items into their shopping cart for a future purchase. They can also log in with Facebook or log in as a guest. Cool, so it's added the image into my cart. I'm going to close that pop up. So I'll just add another one. Great, so now I'm ready to view my cart. Here you can review the products, the price and the quantity and also if you want to um, crop the images at all. You can actually disable cropping so the clients can't touch your images and to do this in the navigation and workspace click sell and shopping cart settings. I'm happy with that. Next is enter your details. Cool, so I'll just fill this in quickly. done and also um, shipping options so I might just go economy and there's always um, a summary on the right hand side with your products here and the the total so I'm happy with that and a final order summary will appear um, just so that you're happy with what you're ordering uh, shipping details and if you've made a mistake you can just click this edit button here and you can tweak that cool and then your client would click process payment and that will take them to PayPal after your clients made a purchase you'll be then notified and assuming you're not self-fulfilled, we'll take care of the rest. I hope that was helpful. Thanks.